Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel PowerPoint University. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to make a good PowerPoint presentation design and I am going to show you some tips and tricks in PowerPoint. When we are told to make a presentation, we end up doing something like this. with lot of text, lot of bullet points, different kind of uh, funny animations and leaving no white spaces or blank space in the slide. So in this tutorial, I am going to show you how I have converted the slide from something like this to like this. If you see, I have used image because we are going to show you about the Uber, so I have just uh, taken one a uh, good cast from the internet and then I've just have a road at the background some buildings and then I have created a semicircle and I have used a lot of uh, icons and giving the text short text so let's see how to do this presentation in PowerPoint before creating PowerPoint presentation follow the below seven steps to create stunning slides the first is don't use bullet points if you want to use use it very one or two bullet points the second is use very good fonts and strictly avoid Comic Sans fonts because Comic Sans is not for the corporate or office culture. The font size should be maintained throughout the slides. If you want to use, make it uh, the ideal size will be 18 or 20 depends on your text. Then use lot of icons for my presentations. I always go to the nonproject.com to get the icons from then use single images go to the net and search for some good images and make sure that you use only one or two images not more than that in one slide and then use only three to four contrasting color avoid giving the colors which are difficult for the audience to read it and the last one is transitions use simple transitions don't use any funny transitions which is not going to work out in your slides so let's start our presentation with the tutorial. I have downloaded some of the images like road, uh, a grass, a background buildings and a car and plus the icons. So first I'm just going to insert the road which I have downloaded from the web. Just increase the size. And then I'm just going to insert a uh, shapes, which is I'm going to use something which is partial circle. Draw the partial circle by holding the shift key so that it will create the same height and width. And then you can just make it to half. Rotate it and increase the size maybe this much just say align center I can increase somewhat big make it align center and bring it down remove the outline and change the color now I'm going to insert which is a 12 point star which is here stars and banners I'm going to select 12 points just drag it and can you see this one small uh, orange dot just drag it inside so it becomes a full only the lines so then just select this one I'm just going to keep it here increase the size sorry select the and bring it here now I'm going to add the lines here okay so if you want to change the direction for example something like this say I should get one two three four five six lines and then I'm just going to shapes I'm selecting the lines and from the center just drag the line till this part all right again shapes lines till here so just repeat it 
till you complete all the six or seven lines so this is my third line fourth line fifth line and the last one is sixth line now select these lines 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6 yes you can move it out and you can just give some different color maybe white and delete this star and select the lines again and bring it to the center now we have the lines ready here now add small uh, six oval shapes we go to insert shapes and select the oval shape and you can reduce the size maybe I'm going to use say 0.7 and width also 0.7 and you can just bring it here if you feel this is small I can just make it maybe one let's make it one and see all right I'm going to give some outlines and I'm going to fill with white and I'm going to just change the background color let me use some dark color later on I can change it then press ctrl D and place it at the end of each line alright and then next is to add the icons which is I have placed it here which I have downloaded from the the nonproject.com now reduce the size and just add it here at the center I have just copied all the icons so just bring the icons here and if you want you can give some different the outer line the border for this I'll just go to format and maybe I'm going to use some dark all right the next is to give the text so in the beginning of the slide I told you that we cannot just add too much text here so always you have to reduce the text and as a speaker as a presenter you have to uh, present it to the audience instead of reading from the, the slide so for this if you see here uh, this is uh, uh, this is one text so I'm not going to take the whole text I'm just going to take only some small text I'll just say for example sorry I'll just say is a cheaper form of transportation I'll just copy only this part control C and bring it here reduce the size and put it here likewise you have to just copy again the simple app whatever you can just pick which is a smaller form and which gives the meaning and then add it here for the rest of the icons and now I have added all uh, the text here uh, the next one I'm just going to insert the car for that go to picture and select any car luxury car maybe I'll select this one bring it here on the road and then you can rotate it uh, horizontal right and just bring the car here 
and then I'm just going to add some background which is the grass and other buildings so this is the grass which I'm going to copy again which I've downloaded from the internet and then I'm just going to insert the buildings and all those things I will select it and send to back all right I'm going to change the background color to some light colors right mouse click go to format background and select some lighter colors all right and now it's time to do the animation for that animation I'm going to bring the car which is outside of the screen and then give the animation let me just bring it full outside of the screen and go to animation enable the animation pane add animation and select lines which is going down so instead of down I'm just making it to appear here at the center alright so if you see here when I click the car is coming I'm going to change the animation effect double click this one and I will just increase the bouncing effect timings I'll make it fast all right and say okay so when I play it will come like this and then I'm going to select the semicircle or the partial circle and I'm going to give the animation for that animation I'm just going to use maybe a wipe effect or right which is from the bottom and this should happen after the car comes so one and then this one and then I'm going to give the animation for each line I'm going to use the animation which is wipe again wipe right which is from the bottom or you can just say which is from right that is after previous and this two objects I'm going to grip together all right and then give animation maybe I'm going to use the animation go to more entrant effects and just say basic zoom say okay and this also should happen after previous after previous maybe I'll make it very fast it's already fast so maybe 0 0.2 seconds so if I play the line and then this is coming all right so similarly I'm just going to use this one and I'll just say up here again make it after previous let me just play all right so I'm just going to copy the animation the first one I'm selecting this line go to animation painter click this line and then group these two objects and select this go to animation painter and click it here and then this animation is simple which is I'm just giving it up here So similarly just uh, do the animation for the rest of this one you have to do just select this one which is already we have done the animation in the animation painter go to or in the animation tab go to animation painter click on the line which you want to do animation and this object again I'm going to group it and select this object select animation painter and click it here and this one also you can select the same thing animation painter and click it here 
So if you see here, just do for the remaining three animations. Now I've added all the animation, so it will look something like this. Now when I click, car comes, then the semicircle, and then each point started to come on the screen. So if you want to add, just add some good uh, uh, headline title here. And if you want to have some more icons, you can just add it icons. So that's it from me, friends. Hope you like this tutorials and don't forget to subscribe my channel, PowerPoint University. Thank you very much and see you soon with more interesting stuff. Till then, goodbye.